Hello. Let's see if this works. Let's see if this works. If you're here and you can hear me, please let me know. I'm also doing my announcements right now. Hello. You can hear me? Okay, perfect. I have to use this microphone that I used, that, well, would use for my, um, for my podcast because this laptop is loud. It's, I don't know if you can hear this. No, you can't. It's really loud. It makes like loud noises. Let me quickly um, announce on Instagram as well that I'm live because last time I forgot. Anyways, chat, how are you? How is everyone doing? Hello, hello. Streamlabs is down, sadly, meaning that I can't see my my, my subs aren't showing up, but I still see you guys. So, Kali Goon, thank you for the sub. Swizzly, thank you for the 25. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. I'm going to try and check it throughout the stream. Um, and if it's back on, I will... Let me see. Uh, streaming. I have everything on stream, el uh, on stream elements except for my... Oh, no, it's still down. Except for my sub goal, uh, my sub goal, my donations. Oh, God, am I yellow? How do I change the lighting? Wait, let me try and change the lighting. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. I hope you guys are doing well. I've missed you. I miss you guys so much. You don't even know. Is this better? I hope so. I don't. Okay. As you can see, I'm standing and I have my laptop on my kitchen counter. I'm quiet. Ooh, how do I change that? I don't know how to change that. Can you make me louder? <laughs> um, I have my laptop on my kitchen counter because I don't even have anything to sit on. You want to see where I've been sitting on for the last, like, week? I've been <laughs> That's where I've been sitting on. That's where I've been having my meals. Um, so, is it, it's very quiet. Oh no, I can try and add a gain. Let me add a filter. Let me try this. Um, gain. Okay. And then it might give us a static though. I'm scared that if I add a gain, it'll give, it'll add a static. So let me know. How's this? Is this good? I hope so. Um, hi everyone. Hello, hello. Where did I move? I moved to LA. I'm in America now. I'm in LA now, which is crazy. Um, because last year around this time I visited this place for the first time and now I'm here. And oh, I have so much to tell you guys. I have so much to tell you guys. I don't even know where to start. I'm going to be honest with you. Um, let me get my chat up on my phone so I have it easier to, uh, see you at all. Um, Oh my God, where do I start? Spill the tea? I mean, there's not that, that I mean tea, you know. Um, I went, there we go, now I can see you guys. Wait, can I see you guys? Give me one second. Um, I went, first of all, I'm so happy to be here. Uh, it's been really cool. I haven't done very much yet. Um, also, I'm gonna start doing my makeup and I'm gonna eat breakfast in a bit. I just wanna talk to you guys for a bit first. So I, um, yeah, I can see you guys now. There you are. Look at you, chat. Um, let me, Tina. Tina isn't in LA right now. I don't think that's secret. She went to LCS. Um, but I will meet Tina. I actually went to her house the other day. Um, <laughs> but she wasn't there, so I technically didn't. I didn't see her, but I will meet Tina. Um, I. What do I, where do I start? I, okay, I haven't done very much yet. I went to Ikea once to get like cutlery and stuff. I'm gonna show you my apartment in a bit as well. Um, but I got like plates and forks and knife, the things that you need in a new apartment. I got that at Ikea, but I don't have any, like I said, I don't have any furniture yet. This is the only furniture piece that I have. His name is Hector and I love him. His name is, look at him. Look at him, how he stands. He looks so cartoonish and fun. He's so big. I love him very much. Uh, so this is Hector. I got him at Ikea. Um, and other than that, I went bouldering yesterday, which is like climbing up like those walls. And 
that was fun. I did that with, I went with Jonas and who else would you know? I went with Jonas, Jen, you might know Jen if you know Jonas and Joel's you might know because he's a Valorant streamer as well. Um, and then with a few other people that I don't know if you would know. Um, but I went, I went out with, I went bouldering with them and it was really fun. Um, and I'm going to do it again. I'm going to join that group because that's really cool. Um, Jonas is the best climbing streamer, no cap. True, Jonas is the best. And no, it looks like the Pixar lamp, right? That's why I got him. Because I think it's really cool that he looks like the Pixar lamp. Um, so yeah, I did that. And then I only got my Wi-Fi yesterday. And it's, okay, chat, it's not smart to give you guys my Wi-Fi password, right? Like, even if I don't give you the name, I shouldn't give you the Wi-Fi password okay so I can't really tell you the story but um, there was a really cute story attached to my Wi-Fi password but I'm not going to tell you show you because uh, apparently it's not smart to give you my Wi-Fi password that's okay um, <laughs> that's fine I won't do that no worries <laughs> um, what else oh oh no I'm sorry the charger of the laptop was in May's food um, yeah, May and Zuko. I have so much to tell you, but I don't know where to start. And now I'm just rambling. Um, but I, um, when I got here, I was so exhausted. Oh my God, chat, the cats. So I had to fly the cats over, right, from the UK. And they got picked up the day before, um, before they would fly, before I was flying, because I was flying on the same flight with them, because I didn't want them to be alone. Um, and I needed someone to pick them up, and I was the person to pick them up at the airport. So I thank you so much, Faith, for the sub. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you guys for the subs. I'm sorry I can't see them. Let me, let me check. If you guys are also checking stream elements, just let me know once it works again. But it's still not working. Ugh, annoying. Right when I'm going live, but I will go live more. I will have to do these streams more because I don't have... Like I don't have furniture, I don't have a setup, um, so I will do these kind of streams more where I just get ready and eat my breakfast with you guys, which I will do in a second. I just want to talk to you for a bit. Um, <laughs> also, let me know who you guys are. Oh my god, I feel like I'm, I'm I have so much to tell you. Uh, back and thank you for the 15. I appreciate it. Um, so yeah, I, 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 the cats got picked up the day before, and I was flying with them on the on the day after, and. First of all, when the cats got picked up, I was trying so hard not to cry because, like, I've never, like, they have been in my arms their entire lives, right? The entire time that I know them, they have been in my arms, and I love them so much, and I was so scared, but I know that they were in good hands, and they were in hands of vets and people who know cats, and it was fine, but I was so worried. And then the day after, I so I arrived at the airport, like, the night before the flight. The flight was, was at 9, um, technically, was supposed to be at 9, p uh, 9 a.m. And I, ri I arrived the day before, like, I think like 8 or 9 p.m. I arrived because I just, I just couldn't wait any longer. I had to be at the airport. I had to be there just in case something went wrong. And then I, I arrived and I stayed the night and I went through security and everything. And I looked at the, um, like, the, the f like, information thing where the flight, information is and it says it's one hour delay and I was like okay fuck um, and I haven't heard anything from the vet people and I didn't know where my cats were so I emailed them and I was like hey the flight has an hour delay how are the cats thank you Carson for the 13 months I appreciate it um, and yeah I was like where are the cats is everything okay did anything happen I haven't heard from you and they were like oh no everything's good the cats like left this morning and I was like okay great so now the cats are left I don't know where they are, and the flight has an hour delay. Nothing I can do. I go to my, like, I wait, I go to my, like, gate, and I ask the, like, um, flight attendants um, if they have seen cats, if they know, if my cats are okay, if they know if my cats are alive, because I haven't seen them in, like, 20, over 24 hours at that point. And I was crying, I was sobbing, I was like, have you seen my cats? Do you know if they're okay? I'm so worried, I don't know and they were like no they're fine like we saw like a bunch of crates they, they said they saw like five crates down there there were some dogs some cats um but then the flight attendant was like 
well, that's a long flight, isn't it? Because it's a t it was a ten hour flight, and I was like, yeah, I know. I just I just want to know if they're okay. Um, and then I googled. And that was the worst mistake because, first of all, I Googled and I was like, are my cats going to be okay on a 10-hour flight? That's me in the background. I don't know if you can hear that. Um, and, and Google obviously says no. Google says no, they can um, hyperventilate and starve and die. And I was like, what the hell? What am I going to do? Just crying at the, at the gate. And this old lady came to me. She was like, do you want something to drink? And I was like, no, I'm good. Thank you. And then... Um, the flight attendant, like the, the you know, like the speaker, speaker comes on, and the flight attendant's like, we're so sorry, guys, but the flight has another hour delay. So now the flight has two hours delay. I don't know where my cats are. My cats are probably already in the air airplane, freaking out. That's what I was thinking. I was like, oh my god, Zuko, he's so anxious. He's gonna die. He's gonna have a heart attack. I don't know what to do. Um, and then I, um. Yeah, and then we board. And boarding was the worst part. Like, boarding and taking off was the worst part because it's loud and it's, like, as a cat, you sit there and you don't know what's ha what's going on. Uh, and so I was just crying throughout the entire time where we were where we were taking off. And then I calmed down a little and I slept through the entire flight because I was exhausted because I didn't sleep for, like, over 24 hours. Thank you for the sub gifts. No, for the subs, Marie. Thank you for the tier one. Thank you, Madri. And thank you, Madri, for the gifted sub. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Um, so yeah, I, was, I, I, I stopped to the entire plane, right? And then when we landed, I was a little more anxious. And then <laughs> this guy next to me, he was so sweet. It was like a Scottish guy, like, you know, he was there with his family. Apparently, Will I Am was sitting somewhere in front of us because I was business and he was sitting in first class. Apparently, I don't know. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I didn't see him, but the guy next to me said that he was sitting there. Um, <laughs> and... So, like, we talked for a little bit, and he, like, calmed me down, and then when we were supposed to end, to, to go off the plane, he, um, he's like, oh, I hope everything goes well, and I'm, I'm like, thank you, thank you so much, I appreciate it, um, but my phone didn't charge the entire flight, and I was like, I just hope that the border control is going to be fast enough so I can see my cat soon, because my phone didn't charge, I was on, like, 10%, um, and I was panicking and then we and then we go through you know when you go through an airport especially when you tra travel internationally you have to go through the airport go through border control and then you can pick up your suitcases so i i arrive at the border control and the border control is the longest i have ever seen like usually they give you like a like a snake queue kind of oh my god amy thank you so much for the gifted subs thank you for the five gifted i appreciate it thank you so much amy Thank you, thank you. Okay, we got some some hearts in chat for Amy. Thanks, thanks, thank you. Um, so yeah, uh, that happens. Look at all those hearts. It's so cute. I missed this. I missed the emotes. I missed you chat. This is fun. Uh, and I'm gonna like calm down a little bit. I just have a lot to tell you. Once I have, once I'm done telling you, I'm gonna start eating. I have like food here. I have like I have a matcha here, which I need to make an iced matcha. Uh, that's another story, which I'm going to tell you in a bit. And then I have like some other food that I'm going to show you. But um, <laughs> I arrive at the border control. And it's the longest queue I've ever seen. It's like usually you go like in like a like a snake like pattern back and forth until you arrive at your gate. The where where the like gates were to like go into the queue, like it was even longer than that. It was like I don't even know how to explain it. It was super long, and I was like what the hell this is just my luck this is just my luck that this is the longest queue that i've ever seen at the border control and i've flown into lax a few times and it's never been this long it's always been long but it's never been this long and my phone's dying and i don't have wi-fi i don't have internet and i'm like okay this sucks i can't like reach anyone the driver who was supposed to pick up my cats because someone went through um, border control with my cats for me to then pick them up at the airport. Um, I does, didn't have my number. He had my friend's number because he needed an American number. And I'm like, everything's going downhill. I don't know what to do. Everything's going downhill. Um, and I finally, once I had like 4% per like battery left on my phone, I was like, I have to do something because um, it still looked like I have like another 45 minutes in this queue. Um, because the queue ended up taking like two and a half hours, I think. Um, 
And so I turn, out, turn around to this woman behind me and I'm like, I'm so sorry. Is there any way you could hotspot me? Um, because I need, to, I need to know where my cats are. I told her the whole story and she was like, oh, we don't have a hotspot either because we're from the UK, um, but there's Wi-Fi here. And I'm like, oh, great. I wish I knew that sooner so I didn't panic as much. But then she shows me how to set up the Wi-Fi and I get a text from my friend who the friend who has the driver's number and uh, who the driver has the number of, I get a text from him and he's like, like 15 minutes ago, he's like, hey, the driver just messaged me um, to pick up the cats. Like now I'm gonna um, start driving. And, uh, and he's like, he's far away. He doesn't live anywhere near LAX. Um, and I'm like, oh shit, no way. There's no way that he started driving now. Cause he was like, I don't know if you're still on the flight. Um, I'm just gonna pick up the cats and make sure that they're safe. And I'm like, first of all, you're an angel. First of all, you are my savior and I love you so much, but also I'm okay, I'm here, I'm alive. And I messaged him back and he said, um, oh no worries, I didn't start driving yet. Um, everything's fine then, I'll give the driver your number. And then we communicated over WhatsApp cause that's what we can do if I have an international number. And then the driver was really nice. He like, he was like, oh, no worries. Like, here's where you can pick up the cats. I'm gonna put them, it was like a, like a shelter, but they, the agency that went through with the cats, they can like rent out rooms for the cats. And I'll show you what it looked like. Cause I have a picture of it. Um, it was quite cute. They had like a little bed in it. Wait, here, they had like a little bed in there where they could hide. And obviously May went out already and looked around. And then look, here's me just like completely exhausted after a ten, well, 12 hour technically flight. Um, God, I was so done with my life. But yeah, he was nice. Everything went, went to plan, everything went well. I could pick up the cats. I picked them up with an Uber, we drove home. My Uber driver, it's really funny. I've had a lot of like, what is it like, East European Uber drivers, like Russian and Polish. And my family is Polish. My grandparents are Polish. So it's like really fun to see other like East, Eastern Europeans um, around here. That's really cool. Um, but yeah, everything went fine. I arrived at the house, I like the apartment. I got my key. I got like, like my welcome package and everything. And then I arrived here and this is where I'm now. And the cats are fine. They like already explored and they didn't care. Um, but my friend who was supposed to pick up um, my cats came over later to visit me. So I'm not alone overnight. Cause I was like, this was so exhausting. I need to see someone. Um, and he came over and he was like, where are you gonna sleep? Cause I didn't have anything. I was like, Oh, well, you know, I have these blankets that I'm going to sleep on because I have like a few like I have like my cat's blankets and stuff. And he was like, you're not going to sleep. You're not sleeping on the ground with blankets over you. And I was like, well, that was my plan. Um, <laughs> and then he took me to Target and I got a blow up mattress. So I now have a blow up mattress and I've been sleeping on this blow up mattress ever since I arrived here. So thank you. <laughs> um, and yeah. That's that. And then the next day we went to, and then I missed my flight. I missed my flight to back to the UK because I was supposed to go back to the UK. And I'm so sorry about that. I was just so jet lagged and like, so like my brain didn't work anymore that I completely missed my flight. Um, but yeah, so when will my setup be here? I don't know because my, an, a moving company took it and they're shipping it overseas and I have not gotten any notifications from them yet. I'm gonna probably email them today <laughs> and ask them where my stuff is because this is awful. <laughs> but until then I might also just, I might get a chair and a desk to at least sit because I'm standing now and I feel like that makes me like a lot more like wiggly. And I don't know if you guys like that. It feels like a commentary YouTube video, right? This is like a, this is what it feels like. It's like a commentary YouTube video. Me holding my little microphone just talking into the camera, like walking around. Hmm, yeah, I think this and that. And then this happened. And I don't know. I've been watching lots of those recently. <laughs> no, I've not been watching commentary. I've been watching like video essays. That's what I've been watching. Um, yeah, so that is my experience. And then I didn't do much. I went to, like I said, I went to Ikea. I went to Target. And then, oh, chat. Okay, there's probably a lot of 
Americans here, right? Actually, no, it's 10 a.m. I don't know how many Americans are awake at 10 a.m. But if you are, commentary featuring Hector. Dude, I love Hector. I want to get, like, googly eyes on Hector because I think that would be so cute. Wouldn't it? Like, some googly eyes. Like, there. That would be so cute. Um, anyways, for, for the Americans, I, I went to Trader Joe's for the first time. And I never heard about Trader Joe's before I came here. But, oh my god, it's so good. Trader Joe's is so, like, actually, like, like S-tier supermarket. Like, I, I, I bought a bunch, like, I bought it, obviously, because I don't have anything, I bought, like, a bunch of, like, groceries, and I bought healthy things, like, I bought eggs, and vegetables, and fruit, and it didn't cost me a fortune. Like, it still cost a lot, as every supermarket does nowadays, but it didn't cost me a fortune, and I was so surprised about that, because usually, and, and I got, I got organic stuff, like, I got, like, organic courgettes, and, like, like, um, what is it, like, free-range eggs, because I don't like, I, I don't like my, my stuff suffering, you know, um, and also I don't trust American antibiotics, I don't know what you pump into your food, but it, judging by the fact, like, that my skin was awful because of the water here, I don't know what, I don't want to know what you put in your food, um, no hate, a little bit against those things, anyways, um, it was great, I love Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's, thumbs up keep keep doing you actually no one thing <laughs> was really embarrassing because <laughs> when I tried to go to the checkout it looked like it was like self-checkout and I had my headphones on so I didn't hear and it looked like it was self-checkout but then there were like like probably like 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 teenagers like you know like high school high school people people who go to high school like working there like part-time and they were all standing on those like like checkout things and holding like the little numbers, and I was so confused at that. And then they they took my like card and scanned everything and put it in bags for me. And I was like, I feel so useless right now. What do I do? I was just standing there like, what am I supposed to do now? Like, do I just do I just wait? Do I just do I do I converse with you do I talk to you? I don't know I didn't know it was weird um that was the one thing that was the one thing that I didn't didn't enjoy but I'll get used to it I think I don't like ha having other people's do uh, other people do my job for me that's the thing um but yeah otherwise it was fun I enjoyed it oh another thing okay there are so many things that I found out recently that I just want to share with you because they are so cool and I've never seen them in my life um I went to I went to a big target, right? And I love the big targets. The big targets are so fun. They're so cool. They're like an amusement park. Um, but I went to the big target. Thank you, Erin, for the T1. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, I went to the big target. And um, my friend was like, oh, we should get Starbucks. There's always a Starbucks in the, big, in the targets. And I was like, okay, that's really cool. Um, and... Then we got our Starbucks, and then we got a cart, and you have, you have, like, cup holders for the Starbucks? That's the first thing. You can put your cups into your cart with cup holders. That's really cool. Second thing is you get free refills of Starbucks. You get free Starbucks refills? What? That's unheard of but it's so cool right right am i right that is so cool i was i was mind blown i was when i heard when i saw that for the first time that was so cool so cool yeah yeah infinite coffee Inf not not just infinite coffee infinite starbucks coffee which is so expensive and you just get it like I guess you have to take your receipt with you, but like that's fine. I'll take my fr I have to, I'll take my receipt with me. Anyways, that was really cool, and I was very mind blown, and I loved that. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much all that happened. Um, 
How are you? Before I... Should I start... Should I eat first and then do my makeup? Probably, right? Otherwise, I'll ruin it. Um... Let me do that. Let me... Let me get my food. My food chat. <clears throat> okay. Good. I'm glad. Tired. Oh, man. I actually... um. I thought I was going to be a lot... Apartment tour? I give you an apartment tour. My apartment... I'm so happy with my apartment. It's so cool. And I'm so excited to furnish it because it's going to be so nice once I furnish it. Chat, look at this. It's a strawberry croissant. And I had a matcha one the other day. I dropped it. Um, it's fine. It's fine. It didn't break. It's fine. <laughs> It's a strawberry croissant. And the thing is, when you bite into it, I'm going to bite into it and show you. Wait. Wait. Can I wait? Can I clip this to me? Wait, let me try and clip this. That would make it so much easier to talk. There we go. Can you hear me? <gasps> is that good? Is that fine? Oh, my God. Okay. So I'm going to bite into it, and I'm going to show you what this is. Because it's... Oh, you can already see it. Like, it's like... It's not just on top, it's also... Oh, hi, May. She's begging. A little quiet. What if I do this? Oh, God. Anyways, um, if I bite into it, it has, like, stuff inside. It's so good. It's so good. So good. Um, and then I also got what did I what else? I got breakfast. I got ooh. I got granola. Wait, is that a potato? Is that a potato in my granola? No way. No way. I think it's a pear. I got granola. I haven't been like. Because I, I got I went outside and I got this at a cafe nearby, but um, I haven't been ordering. I have not ordered anything yet. Just so you guys know, I've been going outside. I've been getting food outside. It's very cool. Um, but I I haven't been eating out much. I have been eating groceries more. But I thought today, no, don't go on my laptop. I thought today, because it's a special occasion. I can I can have food. I can have breakfast. Oh baby. Um it's a change in heat temperature, okay? It's actually not that hot. Like not as hot as I expected. Let me get a spoon real quick. It's actually not as hot as I expected. Um right now I thought it was going to be a lot hotter. But uh, it's probably going to get a lot hotter. I also haven't been outside that much. And there's AC inside everywhere. I, have, I don't have my AC on. I have my AC off. But um, I freeze at night. I'm cold at night. Um... Did I leave the UK? Yes, I did. I left the UK. Mmm. This is so good. Thank you for the hearts. Are we having a heart spam? Let's go. Thank you for the hearts, chat. Thank you, thank you. Okay, should I show you my apartment first? Sorry, my brain is like all over the place today. I'm just happy to be back. I'm just happy to be back streaming. Let me show you my apartment first. I'm back. Did it work? Refresh. Everyone refresh. Okay, anyways, I am gonna show you my apartment. I'm so sorry. I'm back now. Hello. Can you guys see me?
Okay, just a warning. My kitchen is really dirty right now because I don't have dishwasher tops yet. And I have been too lazy to put it all in one place. So it's just all over the place right now. Oh wait, this will dox me. I need to get rid of everything that'll dox me. Just gonna put that in here. Okay. Um, I'm gonna start with my room. I have a two bathroom, two bedroom room. It's gonna be dark because everything's dark here, but this is my first room. This is gonna be my streaming room. This will be where I stream. Right now it's just an empty room with a closet. That's where I have put my suitcases. And then I'm working around with my laptop. It's a little bit um, scuffed. And then this is the first bathroom. This is the guest bathroom and the cat bathroom. This There's the cat lids here, but I'm not going to show you that because it's dirty. This is you guys there. Um, because this is what I have to make do with right now. And then here we have some storage where I store my toilet paper. Nice. Just in case you were wondering where I store my toilet paper, guys. And then I have a washer dryer, which is huge. This dryer, I don't know if you can see how big this is, but like there's my clothes in there, but this is my hand compared to my dryer. It's huge, it's so big. So yeah, this is my, this is my washer. Um, and then my kitchen. I warned you guys, this is my kitchen, it's quite dirty right now, but it's beautiful, it has wide counter, this is where I'm going to do my cooking streams, I'm going to set up a camera like right here, this is where, where we're standing, I'm going to set up my camera right here to like look here, and then I'm going to do my cooking streams, so yeah, this is my kitchen, and then my living room which you've been seeing, it's very empty right now, this is my couch, I hope you like it. Um, lots of cat toys on the ground. <laughs> That's all I have right now. Um, more cat toys. I'm going to put like a real big like sofa here. And a TV on the other side. So I put TV here. I have a balcony, but I'm not going to show you that because I don't want to dox myself. Um, and then this is my bedroom. It currently only has a like MacBook on it. And I tried to stream on my MacBook, but it didn't work, so I had to like borrow this this laptop. And then I have a walk-in closet, which like right now also is pretty messy. This is where the cats have been sleeping. Down here. They have their own little place. And then thank you, Hazelnut, for the raid. And then I have my bathroom, which it's not too messy. I have my I have a really cool like big shower. And the cute thing about this is May has been following me into the shower. She's been like, I've, so I've been standing, it's a big shower, like, let me try and see if I can show you how big this is. Like, I've been like standing here, and the water hits me, and then May stands like there on the other side, just staring at me whenever I shower, which is really cute. And then I have two mirrors and two sinks. I only need one though, because I'm alone. But I use both sometimes, you know, I, I mix it up. Um, and yeah, that's my apartment and I love it. <gasps> Thank you, Frank, for the five months. I appreciate it. Hello. I love it. Always use both things. Yeah, because why not, you know? Thank you, chat. You like it? I'm going to show it to you once it's furnished as well. I'm going to show it to you once it's furnished. It's going to be so nice furnished. I'm really excited. Okay. One thing for each hand? Exactly. That's what I do. Because I'm wasteful. Because <laughs> I'm one of those entitled, wasteful content creators. No, I, I don't even use my sink or my wash. Well, I wash my hands after I pee. But I wash my face with bottled water right now because... I don't know if you can see this, my skin has gotten, it's better now, but it was really bad when I first arrived here because the water here is really bad. Um, so I thank you, baby blue, for the 12 months. I appreciate it. Um, so yeah, I have been, let me check if Streamlabs is back. Um, so, yes, I've been watching it with that, but I ordered a sink filter 
I want it back. That's annoying. Um, how am I going to decorate it? Well, I want to get a, like I said, I want to get a really big couch like here. Um, I want to make my living room my main thing because I want to host like movie nights and game nights and cooking nights. You know, I want to host all these things. Um, so I'm going to make my living room like my main like point of interest and like my main thing that I want to do. So I'm going to get like a really comfy couch, a big TV um, and just like make it really cozy. And then the other rooms, you know. I'm going to use I'm going to I'm going to put my obviously my desk and my chair in my office and then get a bed hopefully this week I'm going to get a bed. So yeah. That's my plan. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. Plants, of course. I'm going to I'm going to get a lot of plants, but they all have to be cat safe because my cats eat plants. Am I planning on doing furniture building soon? Yes. Um, I am low key hoping that my, I ordered a cat tree and it's supposed to arrive today. I'm low key hoping that it arrives before I end stream so that I can build it on stream. Otherwise I might build it tomorrow. But yeah, I'm going to do furniture building streams. Returning to the cat, cat tree. Yeah, I built a cat tree on stream before when I just got Zuko for the first time. For the first time? Yeah, because I got it multiple times when I got Zuko. <laughs> Does my back hurt? Because I don't have a bed right now. Oh, it's fine, actually. It's not been as bad as I thought it would be. <laughs> Um, Zuko times three, times three, yeah, I got him multiple times. That would be great. Multiple Zukos, I would love that. I would love to have multiple Zukos. There's not enough Zukos in this world. Um, but no, my back doesn't hurt. My chest hurts. Like, this area, like here, where like my arms and my, like, chest connect, that hurts. Because, oh my god, chat. Thank you, Dina, for the 12 months. I appreciate it. Have you guys ever been bouldering? It's hard. It's harder. Well, actually, I thought it would be harder. The pecs. Yeah, my pecs. Um, bouldering is like climbing on a wall. Like, you know, these like wall, like, like the, the, like colorful, like wall things that you climb on. Um, it's really fun. And I, I was doing better than I thought I would because I thought I would be way too scared to climb up a wall. But I actually did it. It was fun. But... I'm in pain. Like, we were there for, like, I think two or three hours. And after like, two hours or one and a half, like, after, like, like an hour until we left, I was exhausted. I couldn't move my arms. Like, I tried. I really did. But I just couldn't. Couldn't do it anymore. But it was really fun. Yeah, it's like rock climbing. But is it like rock climbing? Yeah. I think rock climbing must be harder. Did I change my hair color? The black part was brown? No. It just washed out. This is what it washed out to. I kind of like it. You're a professional climber. You understand me? It's pain. I understand you now. Why did I move to LA? I moved here mainly for my friends. I have a lot of friends in LA. And also my friends from the UK visit LA a lot so it's kind of just a hub where everyone meets and then I also moved for my jobs it's a lot easier to work in America than in Europe as a person that has a majority American audience but I'm still gonna like I'm still trying I'm still gonna stream in the morning I'm still gonna do my German streams like not that much is gonna change for you except there might be a few later streams but I'm still gonna try and like accommodate for my EU viewers so don't you worry, I got you. LA is just the pre-match lobby, so true. What happened to my voice there? Did you hear that? My voice crack.
Yeah, I'm gonna grind Valorant. I'm actually so excited for that. I'm gonna be on NA servers, which means it's gonna be so much easier, guys. I hope. That's what I'm saying now. I'll come back to you in a few months and let you know. <laughs> Oh my god, someone just said that. I want to make, so someone said maybe make a family picture with your cats. What I want to do is I want to get a professional photographer. Probably have them come here because the cats are too anxious to leave the house. But I want them to come here and take pictures of the cats and hang them up. And do like a photo shoot with them, not myself, just the cats. And a lot of people I told about that said that it's cringe, but I think it's the best idea ever. Because they are my children, you know. So I'm going to have pictures of my children in my house. Then I love that. Yeah, it's not cringe. Okay, I'm glad. I'm glad you guys agree. Because I love that idea. Hell yeah. Okay, let me get my makeup. Let me start doing my makeup. I'm gonna put my food in my fridge. I'm gonna do my makeup. Wait, you guys can still hear me. I can still talk. What do I talk about? Um, I don't know, my fridge? My fridge is like still empty or empty already from grocery shopping but I, th I don't think it's ever been this full which is funny but I'm gonna start meal prepping again which I'm gonna stream as well I'm gonna stream meal prepping oh I'm also gonna do confessions again so you guys should hand in confessions because I got a few people here in LA who would be interested in doing confessions and maybe I can even do them in person maybe it's not a promise but maybe I'm just gonna do it while standing in my in my camera. Oh. How have you guys' sleep schedule been chat? My sleep schedule has been my sleep my schedule actually has been why can I not speak? My sleep schedule actually has been pretty good. Terrible, bad, really bad. Oh no, oh no, chat. Oh no. Hi David. You sleep schedule is crap. No, chat. Could be worse. That's good. That's a good. That's good. My sleep schedule has been really good actually because um, because I came from the UK here. I've been going to bed at like eight nine p.m. and then waking up at like six seven a.m. which is really good. This is like a, that's a good sleep schedule. I wish that was me. <laughs> Who knows how long it will last. I'm not trying to jinx it. But right now I have a really... And I w I'm trying to keep it because I want to stream at this time. So, you know. I'm going to... Um, so my next plans, my next like week plans for the next two weeks is I'm going to try and stream today and tomorrow. And the day after, I'm going to try. I don't know if I can stream the day after. Um, and then I'm flying to Florida for Creator Clash, um, but I'm leaving earlier than everyone else because there's another thing on Sunday. I'm not going to that. I'm leaving on Sunday because I don't want to leave the cats alone. Um, and then when I come back, I'm going to try and stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. On Thursday, we're going to Coachella, so I probably can't stream there, but I'm going to try and vlog it. As much as I can. Never been to Coachella, which it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna see Suicide Boys. I've only ever seen Suicide Boys on another festival, so that's gonna be fun. Um, but yeah, I'm going to Coachella. I'm gonna try and vlog that, and then once I come back from Coachella, I will try and set up like as much of like a provisional setup as I can, and try and stream actively again. Because honestly, I miss streaming actively, and like I looked at my sub. L nothing you don't have to stop this is not like a, oh well, this is poor streamer doesn't have subs but i look at my subs and i see i can see that like i need to stream 
act more actively and I'm gonna try and do a like get a like provisional setup and stream like hopefully active again because again I miss it a lot I re when I was streaming like how much was I streaming last time like six hours a day it was fun like I actually had so much fun but I was so tired I just couldn't I just couldn't stay live because I felt like when I was tired I wasn't entertaining but now that I can stream in the mornings and I have my morning energy I can hopefully like stream longer and stream more so I'm gonna once I come back from Coachella I'm gonna try and set up something that I can stream more actively on and then once I have my um oh god Oh, I just, I just stopped my piercing into my nose and now my eyes are watering. Oh, God. Um, but yeah, that's what I wanted to say. <laughs> oh, but it's going to be exciting. What time is it in LA? Right now it's 10.40 a.m. Which is a good time. This is a good time to stream. Where's my, where's my concealer from? It's the NYX. HD studio in porcelain how is LA for me pretty fun I haven't done that much yet honestly 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 going bouldering yesterday with the people was my highlight like I like socializing with everyone and doing something like active because I haven't like actively worked out since December because um, I was really depressed <laughs> and um, I really wanted to start working out again once I come here, and I actually have been, and I feel so much better, like, I left, I went to bed yesterday, and I just felt so good, um, and that, so I think that was my highlight, because I'm now surrounded, because nothing against the UK people, I love the UK people, I love my UK friends, but they're not very active, I only have, like, one person that works out with me, and that's Jago, um, and I love Jago, I love working out with Jago, but it's only one person, and um yeah I don't know it just it was just really fun to have like an active group that I could do stuff with but also work out with and socialize with socialize with and it was just really fun and I loved it and I don't know that, that definitely was a highlight for me because I love being active like I have always been except for when I couldn't walk been very I need to blow my nose I'm so sorry um have been very active so yeah, I don't know. Oh, I'm bleeding. My nose is bleeding. That's not good. Okay. It's not much, though. I'm fine. It's just because I stabbed my piercing into my nose. All good, chat. All good, all good. Um, so yeah, that, that was definitely my highlight, and that's what I've been really enjoying. And also all the cool, like, new things. Like, I love moving to different countries. That's why I moved from Germany to the UK. Um, because there are just so many differences and so many new things to learn, and I just really love that. It's so fun. Do you have a favorite flower? It's called angel wings. It's like a big white flower. That's my favorite flower. you take out your piercings when you do your makeup really I can't take out these ones and I probably can't take out my septum I can take out these ones is that what you do do you take out your pier wait guys do you take out your piercings ghost orchids that sounds really cool yeah no no yeah Wait, wait a second. But like, but like some pieces are part of me. They're part of me now. Most people clearly don't. I mean, yeah. I can. If that's what you do. I, I can only take out these ones though. I can't take out the other ones. Because they're like, because these ones, I'm not going to touch these. And this one is like pretty secure. So, okay. That's crazy. 
I've never even thought about that. For some reason, that was never in my head. I can take them out, I got, yeah. Yeah, I can just take them out. They're like little hooks. They're like little hooks. Yeah, you put them. I've never taken my piercing. I take my, I take these ones out a lot to play with them. I do that, I do do that. It looks weird. Yeah, because you're not used to it, Is it, right? Oh, I also cut my bangs. So you can't see that right now because I don't have them in my face. But I cut my I cut my bangs again. So I'm I'm I have bangs again. It was very spontaneous. But I decided I needed to do something. Because I wanted to dye my, dye my hair, but I really like the color right now. So I don't think I will dye my hair for a little bit. With a little bit, I mean I could dye it in tomorrow and say yesterday was a little bit. But who knows? Um, but I need to change something, so I cut my bangs again. Just joined, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Welcome, welcome. I'm just doing my makeup and chatting. Mm. Spotify, I wanna put on music, but I don't think I can put it on my laptop. I would love to put on music. Um, but I don't know if it'll work. I could put it on my phone, but that would like be bad quality. I can try. I don't know if you can hear it though. Yeah, yeah it's like not good. Yeah. That's what you teach it to myself. It's yeah, it doesn't really work. Mm. Let me see. I don't have Spotify installed on this laptop, so let me install Spotify. Spotify bang. Um, Windows. Okay, I'm gonna drag it. Oh, Spotify is already installed. Never mind, I do have Spotify on this laptop. Um, oh, where am I? I don't remember my password. I never do. No? Okay. Mm, no. Okay. I don't know my password. I'm quiet. Sorry. I'm mumbling. I'm mumbling. I'm sorry, chat. I was mumbling. I don't know my password. Oh, I also have my hair in front of my, in front of my microphone. You like my lashes? Yeah, what do you think? Okay, I need honest opinions. What do you think about the lashes? Because I never had lashes, and I always wanted to get lashes. And I saw these ones. I found them on Instagram, and I was like, they are so cool. But I don't know if they're too much. But I did, a lot of people did say that they love them. And I do like them as well. I do think they're really cool. Especially because I look really tired when I don't have makeup on. And now I feel like they kind of wake me up. Thank you, chat. Okay, I'm glad you guys like them. I like them as well. I might get them a little bit less next time. Like a little bit less crowded and stuff. Oh, yeah. Get, give me a pose. Thank you, chat. Can you do more? Um... Yeah, but I, I do like them. Oh, I forgot what I was doing. I was doing my I was doing my makeup. I was doing my my setting powder. You like my piercings as well? I wanna get a full ring for my lip piercing. Let me try and show you what it would look like. Like like that. Wait. I need to like bite on them so you guys can see them. 
Like, I want to get that instead of the half ones. I really like them. But I haven't gotten them yet. Yeah. Thank you, chat. I'm not like those likes and matches. I'm, I'm still quiet. I can add a little bit of gain, but I don't, again, I don't know if that is gonna give us like weird, like noise. Like if I do, if I do this, how is this? Does it, does it give us like a weird, does it sound weird? Sounds fine. A little better? Okay. I might just do this then. A little better. It sounds okay. Okay. I'm sorry. I know this is quite scuffed. <laughs> I apologize, chat. Oh, that's my... It's gonna get better once I have it set up, but I wanted to stream. I wanted to show you guys that I'm here and that I miss you and that I'm trying. I'm really trying. It's more like, it, this feels more like my TikTok lives because this is what I do on my TikTok lives. I just get ready and I talk to you, but I, instead I'm doing it on Twitch now. But I miss Valorant. I'm excited to play Valorant again, chat. And I'm gonna be, I'm gonna play with Jonas again. <gasps> oh my God, I'm gonna play with Jonas again. We used to play so much back then. Jonas, yeah. I'm gonna be in the US. Yeah, I'm gonna be in the US Valorant. Yeah, yeah. I'm so excited. It's gonna be so fun. Oh, there are so many things that I'm gonna do that are so exciting. Like I'm gonna do cooking. I just messed it up. I'm gonna do cooking streams finally. I'm gonna stream Valorant. I'm gonna do confessions again. I'm gonna do. I okay, chat with cutie. Yeah, of course. And not just, but I can cook with cutie as well. Um, <laughs> chat. I was going through my TikTok the other day, like through, through my TikTok likes, and there's there, there are like a lot of tiktok likes that i don't remember anymore like i go through like you know when you're a tiktok your attention span is tiny so even while you're scrolling you forget what you were liking and i went through i scrolled through them and they are so funny i want to show you my tiktok likes because they are so funny cooking with five up oh yeah i can cook with five up as well five up's a foodie five up's a big foodie but yeah, I'm going to show you my TikTok lives. I can't do it now, but once I have a setup again, I will do it. Thank you, Blackshy, for the 10 months. I appreciate it. I'm so sorry that my notifications don't work right now. I wish they were. That's so annoying. Let me see if it works again. Uh, stream. Stream likes. Oh, it's not even loading anymore. Yeah, the site's down. It's fine. But one tomorrow, hopefully, it works again. But yeah, I'll do confessions with Carl. If Carl's in LA, I'll ask him. But Carl doesn't live here, does he? I don't think Carl lives in LA. Am I still 20? I'm 21. Yeah, he, he lives in uh, North Carolina. Yeah, there are a lot of people that I want to do them with. And now I can do them in person, which is going to be really fun. Uh, if they are down. Obviously, not everyone will be, but if they are down, I would love to do that. I think that would be really fun. But yeah. Oh, I'm not any good. I'm excited for upcoming things. Right now, I'm just excited to finally settle into my apartment. I need, I need furniture. I need furniture. Once I have furniture, it will, be, it will be so much more homey. 
but I'm so excited for that. Conventional quackity? True, I could do something with I could ask him. I know he's really busy, but if he's down. There are a lot of people that I would love to do them with, but they're also really busy. So I don't know if like like times would line up, but there are a lot of people I would love to do them with. <clears throat> everyone's busy these days, yeah. Life. We are everyone's going outside again and then trying to it's like it's like the work life balance. Everyone's kinda trying to balance their work and life. Um and I think I had a really bad work life balance for the last few months. Um, but I'm gonna try and have a better one, especially now that I can work in the morning and then go down uh not go down, go offline in the evenings. Happy you're happy? I'm so happy. Thank you, Frank. Oh my god, chat. So Frank's my manager, right? And can we please get some hearts for Frank? Because honestly, without him, I would not be here right now. I would be... I, I don't even know. I was so stressed. Like, this moving was so stress stressful for me. And he has saved my life. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Frank. You're a lifesaver for everything that you do. I, I appreciate you so much. I really do. He's so great. Like, genuinely so great. I was in bed yesterday. I was, like, crying. I was like, oh, my God. All of these people. Like, because Jonas invited me to go climbing. And then Frank has been helping me with everything. And I'm just like, oh, every, everyone around me is so sweet. And I love everyone so much. I'm so grateful. So, like, yeah, I was, like, crying yesterday. Like, grateful for everyone <laughs> and then you guys okay this is another thing um this is like for you guys because I have not been very active and I and and ever since I started streaming I've always had the like the mindset uh, like every streamer of if I'm not active if I'm not constantly streaming if I'm not constantly live I'm not if I'm not constantly posting if I'm not constantly there people will forget about me and I will you know, I, I will lose my job, I, you know, <laughs> all, all of these things, and the fact that you guys are so patient, and here, and understanding, like, when I say, like, I haven't had Wi-Fi for the last week, and I felt so bad for not streaming, like, so many things happened, like, Jonas would ask me if we can play uh, Valorant, and then, like, I think the Dream SMP did, like, something, and then, like, all of these things, where I'm, like, I wish I could be there and I wish I could be online at least and see these things. Like I, I didn't even see anything because I didn't like, where's my phone? My phone, I don't know where my phone is. Oh, my phone's here. Um, like I, I didn't have TikTok. I, I couldn't really go on social media because I pay a lot of money for like, like, like Wi-Fi, not Wi-Fi, like mobile data. So I couldn't, I, I didn't even see anything. And then like, I only could like, start my wi-fi like once or twice a day look at everything close it again um and i would see like all of these things happening and i'm like oh i wish i could be there i feel so bad for not being able to like see anything and like be involved in anything and like the fact that you guys are still here and patient and understanding i i really appreciate that like i, I i'm always scared that it doesn't come across and i'm not trying to be parasocial here but i'm always scared that it doesn't come across how thankful i am for you guys because not even that but also whenever i talk to like brands or other content creators or just friends um they always mention how nice my community is like everyone loves my community brands love working with me because of my community um content creators like i'm not i'm not going to be like oh brands love working with me but no but like like that's the feedback that i get like content creators say your audience is so welcoming your audience is so nice and then like you know my friends are like oh i, I don't feel because where's my other piercing did i lose one of my piercings This is why I didn't want to take them off. I think I lost one of my piercings. Um, but, like, you know, all of these, like, shit. 
I think I lost one of my piercings. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. It's here. Okay, everything's fine. Anyways, continue. Like, <laughs> that's basically all I wanted to say. That you guys are genuinely, like, such a good community. And I'm so happy for that. And I know for a fact that there are obviously, obviously like, a few bad people and a few, like, like like bad things happen here and there but I know that you guys keep each other accountable like you guys hold each other like you like you know like I, I I don't really again I don't really see many things on social media I don't really go on social media much anymore especially Twitter and like I don't I don't like to read through drama and obviously I like to keep updated I like to like stay updated and I couldn't do that for the last few weeks but I I like to know what's happening um and when I see someone that's like toxic or or or, or rude uh, a lot of people are like well you shouldn't do that or like you know I don't know I don't know if that makes sense but our our community I feel like on Twitter I see a lot of like I, I see a lot of like not fan accounts but a lot of people who like tweet about me or tweet about my friends and then every time you got it's like someone involved with Nikki they're really nice and they're really sweet and I appreciate that um but you also keep each other like I don't know if that makes sense. I'm not trying to say anything wrong because I don't know. But I just wanted to say that I appreciate you guys. And I think it's really cool that you guys are such a nice community. And I think it's really cool that what we, like, what we built. It's not just me. Because everyone's like, oh, your community is a direct reflection of the streamer. And it's like, that might be true to an extent. But also, like, a lot of people have, like, really polarizing communities. And I feel like we don't really, like, I feel like everyone's just sweet and everyone's just nice and everyone's just welcoming and I appreciate that. You know, you know, if that makes sense, if that makes sense, chat. And I was just really grateful yesterday. I was just laying in bed and crying and thinking about it because I missed, I missed streaming. I missed, yeah, I felt really, I felt really bad for not streaming. But now I'm here. Now I'm here. The UK will miss you all. I'll come visit, for sure. Still have a lot of friends there. Ooh, what happened to my eyelash? Okay, I've never done eyeliner with eyelashes on. So that's gonna be fun. That's gonna be interesting. Should I like, like sit down? Okay, not bad. That's actually pretty good. Yay. Seriously, we TikTok stream ways. I'm so here for it. Yeah, that's what I what I was saying earlier. It reminds me a lot of my TikTok streams. I like it though. I like my TikTok streams. They're fun. Oh, but on TikTok I can listen to my music. Like on TikTok. Sorry, I need to sit down for a second. Oh my god, I'm doing the Trisha Paytas. You like a chicken nuggets. I'm a chicken nuggets. Um. Anyways, um, what was I saying? I was so stupid. Um, I feel like, yeah, on TikTok I can listen to my own music and I like that. Here I can't because DMCA. And also my, well, it doesn't work with my laptop. The ultimate chicken nugget. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Go. Done. Oh, hold on. I have to throw in the guts a little bit more. Which one is it? This one. There we go. Hmm. Okay. It's so empty. I know. I need furniture. It's gonna be so cool, though. I'm so excited to show you my furnished apartment. 
and like how I furnish it because my other apartment was pre-furnished so I couldn't furnish it myself that was so quick oh thank you yeah I'm trained um I need lipstick though I also need Spray spray. Oh my god, what was that? <gasps> Battery saver is on. You might want to plug in your PC. Oh no, it might die again, chat. Oh, it's lagging. How's it? Oh, that's better. Okay, it actually works. Great. Wait, I'm so orange now. This is not good. There we go. Oh no, did it die again? good now we're back okay i'm sorry i'm sorry guys i'm sorry it's a little scuffed anyways let's put on some spreading spray it's okay now oh do you hear how like loud my laptop is <laughs> we reached the sub goal oh no we didn't yet someone baited me you baited me well still thank you for all the subs today i really appreciate it I mean, it's two more, which doesn't really, yeah. But I really appreciate it. Thank you so much, guys, for all the subs today. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. What is Nikki doing without her being a little scuff? Sarah, thank you for the gifted, for the three-month gift. I appreciate it to Blue Elephant. Oh, wait. I got this for May when I went to Ikea. Isn't this the cutest little boy? His name is Sir Barnsling. And I love him. He's so cute. He's so cute. I got him for May. And I was carrying him around with me when I went through the aisles. Yeah. I think I like him more than she does, though. Because I think he's so cute. And she played with him like two minutes and then left him. Because she has so many toys. She's so spoiled. Um, but I love him. I think he's great. If she doesn't want him, I'll take him. Thank you for the for the tier one, Maggie and Lou. Thank you for the prime. Thanks, guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, everyone. Where are my cats? Should I go see where my cats are? Hello? Anyone here? Anyone here? What the hell? Where are my cats? Hello? Guys, I lost my cats. What the fuck? What? Hello? Zuko? Zuko? I lost my cats. I, I genuinely don't know where they are. I don't have much furniture for them to hide. Am I getting like a bunch of subs right now? Sarah, thank you so much for the gifted. Thank you, Madrid, for the gifted as well. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Oh, my God. Thank you for hitting the sub goal. Thank you. I need to find my cats. Hello? Anyone here? Wait. Wait. Wait, no, actually, where are my cats? Hello? How are you? Oh my god. Wait, that's Zuko. May? Oh my god, they're both here. They were both behind my washer. They must have They must have gone in gone into the like, you know, the little closet I showed you with my washer in? They must have both gone into it while I was showing it to you. And then I closed the door. But they didn't make themselves known. They were just laying there sleeping behind the washer. Oh, you scared me. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. Come here. Come here. You want to say hi? You want to say hi to chat? Oh, you're a big boy. There he is. Little baby. Little baby. Oh, he's sleepy. He's all sleepy. Oh. Oh my god, chat. 
fitting to Sir Barnsley, the elephant that I showed you, look at this. Look at that. It's a little elephant like water fountain for the cats. It's another Sir Barnsley. I love them. They're so cute. They make me happy. And there is another boy that makes me happy. Hello. Hello. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Oh, sorry. Yeah, my cats, so I had to get this because my cats actually don't drink from and like that cup. Um, for the first few weeks, not weeks, I've not been here for weeks, for the first few days that I've been here, um, they had, they had like cups. These are dirty because they just ate out of them. But they had like cups with water in it. Um, but they wouldn't drink out of them. So now I got them this fountain so they would drink out of it. Um, lipstick. That was the last thing that I need to do. Yeah, they're spoiled. They live a better life, life than me, I'm telling you. Actually, actually, I have ordered, so... Today the cat litter, not cat litter, the cat tree is arriving, right? I have already ordered more furniture for my cats than I have because I ordered a tree and I ordered one of these like litter robots because I wanted, because they said that they would like track. Okay, this is really weird, but I saw a TikTok um, of this guy explaining that the litter robot tracked his cats like, I guess like, like toilet times and one time he got a notification that he might want to like check on his cat for like like if he drinks enough and if, if he's hydrated because like the cat didn't go to the toilet enough and then they went to the vet with him and he actually had a problem so I was like okay if that can help me with like figuring out if my cat has a problem I'll get it and also to help me not having to scoop every day which is nice because I have two big cats I have two very big cats um so I'm gonna try it and I'll let you know how it is because I also heard some bad like reviews from it so I'll let you know like in my honest review on how it is um but yeah that's that's one uh, one thing I ordered the elephant's name in English is cute childish that's so cute that's so cute I love that that is so cute This is like lip stain. This is not actually lipstick. It's like lip stain. It's from ColourPop. Oh, you can't see it. It's like their Disney thing. It's really cool. Well, not right now because I haven't put it on correctly. But. There we go. we go yeah I like it I like the color the color is so nice I like it and then it's gonna like fade a little because it's a stain oh yeah congrats on moving help everyone smoothly thank you oh I wanted to make oh I didn't tell you about my story of the matcha so I ordered matcha, uh, I went to the cafe near me, and I ordered matcha, and um, I forgot to say I wanted it iced, and then he made it and gave it to me, and I was too scared to say that I wanted it iced. I think I did say iced, but I was, thank you Madrid for the gifted subs, but I was too scared to say it, so now I'm going to put ice cubes in it. Um, <gasps> Andy, thank you for the 27, oh my god, hi Andy. How are you? How are you, Andy? Um, one really cool thing about LA that I have found is people here speak Spanish, which 
I knew that because I visited before, but people here speak Spanish, so I can like refresh my Spanish here, which is pretty cool. Thank you, uh, Marjorie. Do it. Have I been saying your name wrong? Thank you for the gifted and uh, for the other gift. How many have you been gifted? Five. Thank you for the five gifted. But yeah, I can I can practice my Spanish here, which is pretty cool. Let me put on some ice in my matcha. One second, chat. Oh, I have an ice maker on my on my like fridge. Okay, this might be a little loud. I don't know if it will be, but I have like a. Uh, wow! I have like an ice maker, and it gives me ice. Was that loud? I can't tell. But that was really cool. I now have ice in my matcha, and I'm gonna let it cool. <laughs> it's scary okay oh my god a story about the ice maker actually so it's an ice maker and then it's like a water filter thing like a filtered water thing and what i do is i i put the that water into a filter to like filter it twice because i don't trust american tap water especially la um and i <laughs> i arrived at the at, at the house at the apartment and i when i when i flew in and i was so thirsty i God, I was so thirsty. I didn't have any anything to drink because I just couldn't eat. I couldn't drink until I saw my cats again. Um, and I arrived here and I saw this and I was like, oh, this is really cool. So I tried to put my bottle under it and nothing came out. And I was like, oh, okay. And I never had one of these. Like, I, I've never seen one of these. I've never seen one of these at a friend's place, but I never had one of these. So <laughs> um, definitely got a filter. Yeah, I have like a Brita filter. Uh, I heard that one's good. But I, I tried to like hold it under I tried to get it and nothing came out and I was like okay maybe I need to put water in it so I opened the fridge and it has like a little container where it like flows through and I thought that that's where you put the water in um so I put water in it and it just splashed like out <laughs> like onto my entire fr like 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 kitchen floor it was just wet and I had just been in five minutes I've been into this house and into this apartment for five minutes and it like my entire floor was wet because I didn't realize that that is just where the water flows through. Um, <laughs> so I actually had to hold for like two or three minutes until the water actually went through and in. Um, so yeah, I that's how my story of how I flooded my kitchen within five minutes of arriving here. That's pretty fun. Why do I not trust the water here? Because it ruined my skin. The water here ruined my skin. It made my skin break out so bad. I actually drank American tap water. I didn't. My friend came over and he was like, is there anything you need? And I said, please bring me water. Please, I need water. And then he brought me water. He brought me like a, like a huge... Because I thought he was gonna... Um, it does taste bad as well. That's true. Um, but I was. I thought he was gonna bring me like one water bottle because i was like me and the cats are thirsty he brought me like an entire like like 50 bottle pack of like small water bottles and i was like oh my god what the fuck he's so sweet and then he brought me Lacroix as well because he was like i don't know if you like sparkling water so he brought me sparkling water as well he's so sweet you're gonna you're gonna meet him as well his name's isaac you're gonna meet him as well chat i'm sure you will because he's one of my best friends Um, I've never been to America. No, I've never been out of America, so I know what. So I don't know what's wrong with the tap water here. It's just not good. There's a lot of like, like, like what is it called? Like chemicals in it. Like I don't know if you can see. Or I don't know if you see a difference, but my hair has gotten thinner from the water here. So I need a shower filter. Because I feel like my hair is falling out <laughs> from the water here. <laughs> um, so yeah. And it's like dry. Like my hair here is dry. Usually when I shower, my hair gets really soft. Here, when I come out, my hair is crunchy. So I need to change that. <laughs> Do I miss the UK or Germany? I miss German tap water. Like UK tap water still isn't the best. Like some places are, but not the best. But German tap water? German tap water is good. German, Switzerland, Swiss tap water? 
Mwah, chef's kiss. It's right from the source. Yeah, that's the one thing I miss. <laughs> Crunchy, yeah. It's like, well, not, not as bad, actually. It's not that bad right now, actually. But it's like crunchy. It feels crunchy. German tap water is good. Yeah, it is. Spanish tap water is the absolute best. Actually, when I lived in Spain, our tap water had chlorine in it. So we weren't able to drink our tap water in Spain. But maybe it's different on mainland and island. Maybe. Swedish tap water. I can imagine Swedish tap water to be good. You know which what tap water is really good? Iceland. I, I've never been to Iceland. I always wanted to go. Never been to Iceland, but Iceland has really good tap water from what I heard. How did your family react when you told them that you've moved? Actually, um, I don't know if my further family knows. I told my mom, um, and it's really funny because so growing up, my mom never like like we grew up in like a really like how do you say it? like I guess like traditional German family where it's like you study, you work and you have to be successful like you have to go to school you have to be successful like my family is like doctors and stuff so growing up i never really heard from her that she's proud of me like it was just never something that you would say like in germany that's like if you have german parents you know your parents like they don't tell you they're proud of you um but like she told me she was proud of me when she like heard about my job and found out what I was doing but recently um when I moved here when she found out that I was moving here she's been telling me so much like she's been she's been like calling like whenever I call her because I've been calling her because I have like weird times that I can call but I've been calling her and she would every time without a doubt she's like I'm so proud of you I hope you know how proud of you I am and I'm like what the fuck what the, what the hell mom I don't know how to react to this I never grew up knowing I I haven't heard these 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 words in my life what do I say how do I react so I'm just like really awkward like thank you <laughs> thank you because I don't know what to say but it's like nothing bad like I love my mom and she's great but like it, it just wasn't something that I was used to um but yeah like ever since my mom found out because she because uh, she's, she's also like my mom loves the warmth and I'm like living in the like best area that she always wanted to live in so yeah she's like she's like really jealous she always asks me how's the weather <laughs> how's everything there and I'm like it's great <laughs> so yeah 31 months thank you so much uh, as look for the 31 months I appreciate it. holy moly holy moly you're proud and happy thank you chat I am so excited for the future like genuinely I feel like a whole new chapter has started and I feel like it had to ha it had to happen like this chapter had to start at some point because I feel like I was just stuck in limbo while I was in the UK like I was kind of just drifting but now I have plans and now I have people behind me and now I have like like not that I didn't have people behind me in the UK but I have like like ambitions you know I don't know and like people who push me like my manager like Frank he's there and like stuff like that and I'm so excited I feel like it's it's gonna be so cool it's gonna be fun I'm gonna take you along with me and I'm gonna and I'm gonna t tell you all the fun things that I find out like how Target has Starbucks and you can put cup and you have cup holders on your on your on your cards that's so cool that's so fun I love that so fun thank you Kyodu, for the prime i appreciate it any news on the podcast nothing i can say they they are like it's in the works but there's nothing that i can say sorry my nose is running again <clears throat> does my mom watch my streams um i think she used to I think she she probably watches my German ones, um, but she's busy as well. 
my mom's a busy woman. She works. Um, so I think I I don't I don't really stream on good times for her to watch. But I do think some sometimes she watches. I don't know how much she understands, but yeah, I think she watches sometimes. I think I've got go. Uh, am I thinking about going to Twitch Con Paris? Yes, I will be going to Twitch Con Paris. God, my nose is running and running and running. It's annoying. Sorry, guys. Oh, I need to put my piercings back in. I I almost forgot. That's another thing. I can't take them out because I would forget. I would just forget. Okay. Do you want to see how easy it is to put them in? I do need a mirror though because I need to find the hole. Um. So you just find the hole. And then you put this little bit in, like that. You like put it in. You need to hold it. And then you kind of just twist it and push it. Oh, it's not working right now. Of course, because I'm trying to show you. Usually it's very easy. Boop. Boop. Why is it not working? Maybe it's the other side. Maybe this is the other side. No. Huh. I swear it's easy normally. I swear. I I swear I don't have because I fidget with it. I promise chat. Oh no. There we go. Um and then you turn it. No. Why is it not working? Thanks for the hearts, guys. Thanks for oh, there we go. Yeah, you kind of just twist it and push it. Thank you for the hearts, everyone. I appreciate it. Thank you for the hearts, spam. Thank you, thank you. Okay, another second one. Hopefully, this one is easier, so I don't embarrass myself again. So you put it in, and then you twist it and you push it. Yeah, there we go. You didn't see that my hand was in front of it, but. It is easy to put in, <laughs> normally. How's my day going so far? Good, I woke up, I did laundry, and then I went to a cafe and got breakfast, and then I started stream. Pretty good, it's pretty nice. I have a um, consultation for, so I usually wax my hair off, like I've been going to waxing for about a year and a half now and that made my hair like grow back not as much I'm gonna show you but I can't um it made my hair grow back not as much um but I've been thinking about doing laser because everyone every time I'm like oh yeah I, I, I go waxing they're like have you tried great laser and I'm like no I haven't should I and they're like yeah no it actually was really good so I'm I have a consultation for laser because I have quite like like light hair so I don't even know if it will work so I had to go and ask first, and that's what I have at 1.30 today. Um, and I'll let you know. i let you know how it is. I'll let you know how it goes. But um, I want to try it. Because I, I like wa I like waxing is fine, because I only have to do it once a month, and it doesn't grow back as much. But if there was a way to do something where my hair doesn't grow back, that would be fun. Not that body hair is bad. I had like like long body hair when I came here. But I want to wear... I just don't like the feeling of it. And I want to wear like um, like shorts. So it sounds painful. I'll let you know. I'll let you know. I also don't know if I can do it with my tattoos. Like I don't know if I... I don't know if I, I can even do it. Because I have tattoos on my legs. I don't know how it works. Is it the same laser as tattoo removal? Because I wouldn't want to remove my tattoos. But, you know, because of that, I have a, I have a consultation today. Is waxing painful? You get used to it. So, like I said, I do it once a month. Or I did it once a month. And it definitely, like, it's not nice, but you get used to it. And the more you do it, the less you, like, care, I guess. It's a different laser. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. Um, but also it depends on what kind of hair you have. Like I said, I have really thin blonde hair. 
so for me it's not bad but if you have like really thick black hair it'll probably hurt a lot more <laughs> and also depends on the area my underarms are painful waxing my underarms is painful they have bled before i don't know if that's too graphic i'm so sorry but i feel like it's an interesting thing like i feel like if you want to if you if you're interested in it you know you want to hear people's people's experiences and that was my experience yeah <laughs> I guess I guess it is because your um like layer of skin is just like lighter or like like thinner. Uh thank you Casberry for the two one. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I don't have to explain myself. I just like to share my experiences with uh, with you, especially because I know a lot of you are like probably femme presenting like there are probably a lot of like femme presenting viewers and these are things that i didn't learn until i did them <clears throat> laser isn't too bad since you have a pine pain tolerance you will be fine okay yeah i don't think it'll be too bad i'm not that scared of it I feel like waxing is much better than shaving because after shaving your oh it always grows back so weirdly. That's what I yeah, that's why I did it. Um because like even now, so when I came here, like I said, I had like really long hair and I I shaved it because I didn't I don't have anyone to wax me here. Um in the UK I have like a lady that does it for me every month and I know her and I trust her, but I I don't know anyone here. So I I shaved it and it's already grown back like like really stubbly and just harsh and I feel like waxing just doesn't do that or if it does it it does it like like two weeks later so you have like a like time so yeah that's kind of my experience with it hmm. My lashes came out sick. <gasps> Can't wait to go rock climbing again tomorrow. Yes! I'm so excited and thank you. Yeah, I do like them. Oh, I can't wait to go climbing. I actually like I woke up this I woke up today, this morning, and I was like, I wanna go climbing. I think I'm addicted, chat. I think I have an addiction to climbing now. I think I have an addiction to climbing now. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I feel the same. Yeah, it's crazy. Cory is quaking. Yeah, Cory is a climber. Cory always wanted to get me into climbing. Um, and then yesterday, I sent her pictures. Wait, I was so proud. Um, I was so proud. I sent Cory pictures. I was like, she's gonna be so happy. Look, it's me on top of the thing. And I sent her a picture, and I was like, oh, I went. I'm climbing. Look, Corey, I'm climbing. <laughs> and she was like, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's so fun. I'm so happy. I'm so happy right now. Like, everything is kind of falling into place. And I, I'm i so happy. To, I don't know. It's so, it's so crazy. You were so happy when you sent me the pic. Let's go. Corey is a proud father. Proud father moment. <laughs> Nikki is a pro climber next up Mount Everest. If you saw me yesterday, you would not say that. Because even though it was fun, I was not the best. Like, I was not really good at it. <laughs> I was better than I thought I would be, but I was not good at it. Yeah. Okay, I don't know. What else do we talk about? I'm trying to, like, think of topics that I, or things that I could tell you. But not much has happened. Like, not much more. That's kind of everything that I, that happened. Oh, no, wait. Oh, because I'm going to Coachella, right? I bought, like, a bunch of, will I open a P.O. box? Yes, yes. 
that's actually something I'm going to write down for my meeting tomorrow. Because um, I want to find out how to do that. I have a note somewhere. Where is it? Yeah, here it is on my Amazon information. There we go. Um, P.O. Box. <clears throat> P.O. Box. Okay. Um, yeah, so I, I, I went to Coachella. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm, I haven't went. I'm going to Coachella next weekend. Not this weekend. Next weekend. Um, and I bought outfits. And I... I ordered shoes, right? Um, and I and I and I I looked at my shoe size and I looked at their shoe size and I was like, oh okay, size six. No wait, what what was it? Size five. Size five. I'm sure I'm a size five. Um, yeah, I'm a size five UK. I'm a size eight US. So I bought these shoes, and they're three sizes too small. So uh, <laughs> I'm going to have to go to the store next week or this week and change these shoes because I ordered them too small. I ordered them three sizes too small, so I can't wear those now. Um, <laughs> and that's upsetting. But I don't know what else I could show. I could tell you. Oh, sorry, that was loud. I don't want to show you my outfit yet because I want to vlog it. I want to vlog Coachella. Um... Who are some people I want to meet up with? Connor. Um, so I met Emma a few days ago. Tell us about your single player game schedule. Oh, I did that last time. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna do that afterwards. But I I met Emma. Um, I met up with Emma. Uh, and that's what that's like the one person that I wanted to see like really badly. And Jonas. And then Connor was the other person that I really want to see. Um, and my friend Isaac, but you don't know Isaac because he's not a streamer. But my um, Connor, I really want to see. But Connor isn't available right now. Ugh, angry. I want to see Connor. Tell Connor I want to see him. No, no, don't. Don't harass him. He knows. <laughs> he knows I want to see him. I've been harassing him. Connor has in Connor eats plans. Yes. Connor has in Connor eats plans. I really want to see him. My single player game starts. So when I come back from Coachella, I'm hoping that I can get a setup together where I can play uh, my single player games on. And we still have to play The Walking Dead. And I'm going to do longer streams now, which means I can play like multiple episodes of The Walking Dead in a day, which means we get through it quicker and we get more content. And that's fun and that's great. So I'm going to play The Walking Dead when I'm back. And then I think I'm going to start the Resident Evil games. Because they're fun. And Sally Face after that. Oh, should I do... Because this is a game series. Should I do game series, single player game series? Because if I do... Or single games? Because if I do The Walking Dead, I could then play a single game. Which I think Sally Face is. There is no second Sally Face, right? So I think I'm going to do The Walking Dead, Sally Face, and then Resident Evil. And then another single game. This is, this is my list chat. The, this one, the long one, that's my list of all the games that I want to play. <clears throat> so, yeah, but I, I think I told you guys in detail already, but I think that's going to be the next one. Yeah, I want to play the Resident Evil games, because I haven't played all of them yet. I think I only played one before. Not, not Resident Evil 1, but one game. So, yeah. Sally Face has very annoying puzzles in it. Don't forget Alice Madness Returns. I know, it's on my list. Um, I do have it written down, the Alice games. But now that I'm in America, I can try and get the game before Madness Returns. Which was like, I think, what was it called? It was something, something Alice. Um, and I want to I wanna play that as well. Undertale? Ooh, maybe. We could play some Undertale as well. I think that's on the list as well. Are there any more German streams planned? Yes. Um, obviously, the German streams are mainly like game lobbies with my friends. 
I do want to react to some more things. Um, I think I have some like German TikToks in my leg that I want to show you because they're fun. Um, and then Game Bobbies with my friends. And I know there are a few YouTube series that we... I don't think we're going to continue reacting to Seven vs. Wild just because it's been so long. But I'll definitely like try and react to more things on there. And I want to do more, there are so many plans I have chat. I want to do more, um, like, lobbies with the girlies. I love the girlies. Ghost hunting? Like, IRL ghost hunting? I don't know if we can stream that. But there's, like, this, sorry, my nose has been awful today. I don't know why. Um, I don't know. There's this other game that's not Phasmophobia that's, like, really good right now, right? I want to play that. <clears throat> Will I do vlogs in LA? Yes. I'm going to do a moving vlog, which I'm currently filming. Um, I'm going to vlog, hopefully, Creator Clash. I don't know, because I'm not there for too long. I'm not going to see too many things, but I'm going to try and vlog that. I'm going to vlog Coachella. Um, and then just, like... Just like random vlogs, you know? Random vlogs. That would be fun. I want to do more vlogs for sure. I do enjoy the most. I still, I'm still working on the Streamer Awards vlog. Um, I kind of stopped working on that because I tried to settle into this apartment that's been really busy. But um, once I have settled in more, I'm going to finish that vlog. What lashes am I wearing? I'm wearing lashes extensions. These are extensions. They're like bottom as well. Do you want to like hear the name of the people that I got the lashes from? Just so you guys, in case you're in LA. Um, they are called Candy. No, Candy Beauty Lashes. Candy Beauty Lashes. That is them. Oh my god, there's me. <laughs> Just in case you guys wanna um wanna find out there yeah I'm I can't I I can't speak anymore. Just in case you guys wanna know. This is the most talking I've done in a week. <laughs> You're the reason I got into learning German? Let's go. How is it? I'm sure it's hard. What does he have planning to meet? Oh, I also want to meet Corpse. Corpse and I have been talking like about meeting up for probably over a year now. Like probably even before I went to LA for the first time, I was like, oh, I want to hang out. So I want to be close, <laughs> finally. Now that I live here, I finally want to meet him. Because <laughs> he's great. I love him very much. He's very dear to me. Okay, chat. Um, I think I'm gonna... Go I was gonna say I'm gonna hang up now. I think I'm gonna hang up now, chat. That was a fun video chat that we had. No, I think I'm gonna um, go now. Because... I have to like fully get ready before my consultation and I have to go for my consultation. Um, but this was really fun. I'm going to be back tomorrow um, and I'm going to probably build the cat crate tomorrow. Like I'm going to do a similar thing like this tomorrow just because that's the only thing I can do right now. Um, and I'm going to build the cat crate tomorrow because it, it will arrive today. And then maybe build other things if I have any. Um, but yeah, it was really fun. Thank you for watching, guys. Do we rate someone? Who can we rate? Let's see. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look on my phone who's live. I hope this wasn't too scuffed. I know this is, like, not the best, but it's all I can do right now. So, you know, I try. I try, I try. Um, Amesy? Should we write Amesy? Let's write Amesy. Um, slash rate Amesy. 
Does this work? Yeah. All right, go and give MZ my love, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I will see you guys tomorrow. And I hope you all are having a wonderful morning, evening, or day, wherever you are. And thank you so much, again. I really appreciate you guys. Bye-bye.